AWS, Azure, and GCP don't handle basic security functions in the exact same way. There are nuances that have to be taken into account in order for security measures to work properly. The professionals that understand these nuances are not easy to find. And you don't have to take my word for it. That is a direct quote from Shai Morag of the Forbes Technology Council. And that's exactly why we wrote this course, SEC 510 Public Cloud Security, AWS, Azure, and GCP. Because multiple clouds require multiple solutions. We here at SANS surveyed many organizations and found that the vast majority of them use all three of the big three cloud providers. And that's why individuals who work in your organization across those three cloud providers would benefit greatly from SEC 510. It'll teach them how to secure the various platforms used in your cloud environments, specifically focusing on how to implement defense in depth for your identity and access management in the cloud, how to build properly segmented networks in the cloud, to handle the security of your data, both from the confidentiality, integrity, and availability perspective, and how to scale these solutions through automated checks. While SEC 510 will be so valuable for your organization, it's also going to be a lot of fun for the students. They get to deploy and explore a real multi-cloud environment in real cloud accounts. They will break functionality within that cloud account to understand the importance of various security controls. They will also learn how to read and write Terraform infrastructure as code, which is so valuable for automating security controls across a large organization. They will learn how to implement defense in depth capabilities so that when things go wrong, they are mitigated by other controls. And it's so valuable to the students to have this experience with all three cloud providers. Very few people in the world understand how to secure a single cloud provider. Students of SEC 510 will be able to confidently secure both AWS, Azure, and GCP. And last but not least, you can win one of these awesome challenge coins if you win the bonus challenges. As a 500 level course, SEC 510 is made for mid-level practitioners. These can be security analysts, engineers, architects, and DevOps professionals. Or anybody who is responsible for building the cloud, researching the cloud, and securing the cloud. SEC 510 Public Cloud Security is part of several of the SANS Cloud Ace journeys. We created these cloud security journeys to help guide professionals along a specific training path by a common job role. A deep understanding and hands-on ability in the multi-cloud arena is critical for analysts in order to enable comprehensive defenses to common attacks, engineers in order to create security configurations and build secure integrations across multiple services, architects in order to effectively design multi-cloud requirements, and DevSecOps automation professionals in order to automate security across multiple clouds using infrastructure as code. You can review the journeys at sans.org slash cloud dash security slash ace. SEC 510 has five great sections that will help you navigate multi-cloud security. It has 20 lab exercises and many more bonus challenges during our extended hours. It also has a GX certification associated with it the GIAC Public Cloud Security, or GPCS. You can take SEC 510 in a variety of different modalities, live in person with an instructor, live online with an instructor remotely, on demand where you can take it at your own pace and get help from subject matter experts, and private classes which are meant for large organizations that need to train a large number of employees. SEC 510's latest version has a lot of new great content. We're going to teach you how to integrate the different cloud providers with one another without using long-lived credentials. Long-lived credentials are really problematic in multiple cloud environments because if that credential is compromised, it will be useful for a very long time. We eliminate those long-lived credentials so that you can ensure that compromises are short-lived as well. We also have new content on data loss prevention using Amazon Macy and using Google Cloud DLP so that you can find the sensitive data in your cloud environment. 
We have also added some enhanced cloud security posture management labs, including one that allows you to use multiple cloud providers and scan them using Microsoft Defender for Cloud. We also have countless new cloud developments. As we all know, the cloud evolves very quickly, and we have kept up to date with all of those new developments, and you're not going to want to miss them. Finally, SANS will provide the student with an AWS and Azure account. As a result, they will be able to complete the labs without having any additional cloud spend. You can check out SEC510 at sans.org slash SEC510. And make sure to click the course demo button at the top of the page, which will allow you to enroll in roughly an hour's worth of content completely for free. If you have any questions about SEC510, public cloud security, AWS, Azure, and GCP, feel free to reach out to me on LinkedIn under Brandon Evans or email me at bevans at sans.org. And of course, please check out sans.org slash sec510, click that course demo button and enjoy that free content. I hope to see you in a session of sec510 in the near future.